gave the illusion like I was snitched. I'm like, girl, mm, fire. Wagwan beautiful people, I am Chef V. For new to this channel, welcome Wagwan. Make sure you are subscribed down below. In today's video, I am about to do a what I wore on vacation slash lookbook. For the last four months, I've been on three different vacations. We went to Colombia, we went to Tulum, and then we just went to St. Lucia. And I had a range of different colorful outfits that you guys wanted to know where I got them from and how I style them, especially since summer is coming up. So even if you're not going anywhere right now, it's a couple of ideas that you can mix and match to create a whole vibe because I love colors. I just love bright colors on vacation, especially when I'm going to tropical places. Like it just, it's just life. The colors give me life and it brings out the melanin in my skin. I'm just obsessed. Everything that I will be talking about or listing will be in the description box down below. Some of it will be commission based link because this video isn't sponsored. I have my own magic link that you guys can click on and purchase through there. It won't be any extra charge to you. Just letting y'all know. So let's start with Colombia. Now the first outfit in the Colombia trip was this white two-piece set and oh my gosh, I saw this set on Instagram on someone else and I couldn't find it because they didn't put where they got the set from. Two months I was looking for this set until I finally found it on pretty little thing you can wear it as a cover-up because it is a beach cover-up or you can wear it like i did in the nighttime like a nightlife type of vibe like a little sexy mamacita type of look that's what i was going for with that set and then the earrings i got from pretty little thing as well and also the shoes so the entire outfit was from pretty little thing including the body chain got the skirt in a size large and honestly i could have gone with the medium because it is a tie skirt and the top i got in a size medium and then i just wore it off the shoulder type of vibe if you're not flat stomach like myself you know you got a little bit of love handles here and there you know you got something your man usually holds on to a body chain just gives sex appeal it gives sexy without having to have that you know typical idealistic image of what a it body looks like the body chain gives sexy regardless of your body type so i absolutely love body chains i just love them i don't know if you call them body chains or would they be just waist chains someone did tell me a trick to use I think it was clear nail polish on your imitation gold type jewelry and they do last longer. I'm not a heels type of girly on vacation but I do feel like you always need at least one pair of universal type heels that you could maybe wear with anything if you're not a heel type of girl so I recommend at least one pair on vacation. Now moving on to our second outfit in Colombia baby the melanin. The melanin was shining, shining, shining. Now the skirt, I got it from Shein, and it is a part of a two-piece set, so it came with a tube type of tie top. So when I bought it, I'm like, mm, this is giving very much Cartagena, Colombia. But when I tried on the skirt, I'm like, you know what? I don't wanna go with this top, I'm gonna go, I need that orange top. So I got the orange top also from Shein, and I got it in a size medium. And when I tried those on, cause I did try it on for you guys in my vlog when I unpackaged the Shein package. When I put them together, I'm like, yeah, we're definitely wearing this in Colombia. The color in the sunshine, oh my God. The skin was giving rich. The skin was giving rich, Nest, it was giving glow, black girl magic. Sandals and the bag as well is from Shein. So Shein has some nice pieces, so you don't have to go typically just with whatever you see just right in front of you. I like two-piece sets 
and I feel like they're so easy to you know just style they're super easy but it is important to have that eye for switching up the two pieces like switch it up you know the earrings are these earrings that I'm wearing they are from my jewelry collection from Beyond Empress on my website House of Chef B now as of this video going up I don't know if I've launched yet but keep a lookout if I haven't, if I have, you guys will know and it will be in the description box down below. Either way, the link to my website will be down below because I do have nose jewelry as well. So I'll leave that down below anyway. But I don't know when exactly I'm going to be launching. I just need to do some product shots and all that good stuff. But they are my signature gold earrings that I wear with practically anything, any time of the year. Love them. It brings on my face. It's, it's, it's everything. Moving on to our next vacation look that was absolutely popping, sexy, spectacular, is this swim suit outfit. So the bathing suit, top and bottom, from Pretty Little Thing, the cover up is from Pretty Little Thing. Now with the cover up, most of my ideas are Pinterest inspired, so I didn't come up with this outfit myself. I saw it on Pinterest. Pinterest on someone else. I'm like girl mm, Fire I went on pretty little thing. I looked for like a sand Tan type of bathing suit and they did have this cover-up the thing is the cover-up is not a skirt It's just like a full cover-up But I wanted to wear it as a skirt So I tied the straps on the side and of course, you know, we got to go with the belly chain We got to go with the waist chain. So I added the waist chain to the outfit mm gave the illusion like I was snitched okay snitched for the gods signature earrings again and the bag that I'm wearing is from pretty little thing now I did get the bag from a pretty little thing event that I attended in Toronto last summer so I don't the bag is on their website anymore you can get a vacation bag from different places you can get it from Amazon you can get it from Fashion Nova like you there's different places that has vacation bags So I'm gonna try to see if I could find it and find an alternative and see if we could put that Down below for y'all. Okay, and the sandals. I've had those sandals for at least two three years I'm not sure but I did get the sandals from Zara the bangles I got from Shein they were like two dollars each when I got them two dollars Canadian so I got three of those and they come with me every vacation. And the sunglasses Lorve, um, that's Diera's sunglasses collection. Chef's Kiss, love it. I love those sunglasses. I take them with me every tropical vacation. Even if I don't wear them, I never know when I'm gonna put them on. So I take it with me. So the next outfit that we wore was this white tannish outfit. Top and the skirt is from pretty little thing i got the top in a medium but honestly i feel like i should have gone with a small because it was a bit big for me and the skirt i got it in a large because i have a little booty you know what i'm saying i got a little badonk -donk in the back so a lot of times when i buy a skirt i just stick with large because sometimes they don't fit and then we have that pretty little thing bag that i don't have the link for but we're gonna find something for it and the sandals is from she in now let me tell you something as someone who owns designer sandals that cost thousands of dollars i prefer to bring my she in sandals on vacation it's just that thinking about it now having designer sandals and going to places that have like rocky grounds and a lot of dirt and stuff your sandals get ruined. They get ruined so much faster. And I'd be really upset spending all this money on sandals. And then mash up. Then mash up the sandals not good again. Well, I'm still good, but them just have, you know, like tears and weirs all over them for a thousand dollar sandals. No. So I get majority of my vacation sandals from Shein. And I love them earrings i got from she in as well we're gonna double check that but everything will be listed in the order of me telling you so don't worry it's gonna be there so i think i got those from she in and then the typical jewelry um you know we gotta go with the waist chain again but this outfit was so easy and flowy and it was just a vibe now this outfit right here this is the, the outfit that i was wearing when i got engaged 
This set, I got it from What Jordy Wore. I think she's an influencer or a public figure, I'm not sure, but even though I shop on Shein, a lot of times I want something different. You don't wanna always wear something that everybody else wears. So I needed something different. So I was searching on Pinterest and there was this other outfit that I saw then. I discovered the website before the page and I saw this set with the kimono and the pants and then it came with a, um, a scarf. I'm like, I need that. I need this set. It was so freaking beautiful. It I was scared of how it would fit because it was like size four to 12 but I'm like I'm like size 8 10 like you're telling me this fits everybody but she fits so good I got two I got a yellow floral print one and I got this pink and white one beautiful and what I love about pieces like this is that you would wear them again and again in different ways like the kimono I would wear with maybe shorts and a cute top on a different trip or I could wear it as a beach cover-up. I could wear the pants going out with a nice silk satin type of top. Love it. I knew something good was ha gonna happen that day and I dressed accordingly. <laughs> and then I just um, got a white bathing suit. Instead of wearing the, the scarf, you can wear it as a top or you can wear it as a head tie. But um, I left that out and I got a white bathing suit from Pretty Little Thing and then we got the bangles from Shein and what earrings was I wearing? I was wearing the signature earrings like the earrings go with everything. The necklace I was wearing is from Zara and this was in this was December 2022 so I don't think it's on Zara anymore but you can always get like those choker types looks because Zara does come up with different variations of their jewelry and then for jewelry a lot of times I wear this set of jewelry this is also gonna be on the site um, this is from my line as well so we're going to add these I just need to get the product photos out I don't know why I'm taking so long but we're gonna get it out okay y'all we're gonna we're gonna get it now moving on to our trip to Tulum Tulum is always a vibe like that's a lot of people's go-to spot it depends on how you want to do Tulum people like to do Tulum in nudes like I like nude shades and neutrals and whites and stuff but for me in Tulum I was gonna go with the color the first outfit that we're gonna go with is this bathing suit set that I wore from Shein loved it I don't know what it is it's something about the Caribbean Sun that just does something to me a lot of times with bathing suits especially from Shein sometimes it's not very girl thick girl in the front friendly and I don't like that because it's like I need my top I need my area covered who said I wanted the sides to be out I know a lot of people like that but I don't like that. I like my I like my I like my hoo-ha covered, fully covered. Like, you know, I could show a little back action. I don't mind the booty cheeks out. That's the booty cheeks, it's fine. It's gonna be out regardless. But the front, I don't need any lip slipping. Like who, who wants that? So that's always been my issue with a lot of newer style bathing suits. But this style, it was fully covered. A lot of times I prefer to, you know, get a small or medium top for my boobs and then get a large or extra large for my bottoms because how my body is rationed how my body is proportionalized I am bottom heavy but uh, I got a large and it fit well it fit really nicely the the top obviously was adjustable so it didn't look too big like it wasn't my right size because it had the the bra cuff thingy my jigs in there the kimono, real nice. I wish the sleeves were a tad bit longer, but they were. it was really nice. It was flowy. It was gorgeous. It was true to color as well, because a lot of times that is an issue too, is that the clothing aren't true to the, to the brightness, but it was definitely bright. For the next outfit, very simple, but it was very beautiful. I wore this for like a breakfast type of vibe. The skirt is from Pretty Little Thing and the top 
the top i've had that top for a while but i think you can get it on pretty little thing as well it's just a simple bodysuit and then i'm wearing that sandals a white sandals from Shein as well and for the jewelry <laughs> the signature earrings again <laughs> like listen if i could go on vacation with one piece of jewelry well not one because i would have my rings too but my nose ring but a very staple jewelry in going to vacation that would always be my luggage is these earrings love them okay love them if i'm gonna sell a product i gotta be in love with it right like i feel like you deserve this as well and then the bag is also from pretty little thing so it's a it's a full bag it's it's giving life this dress right here i've been eyeing this dress for the longest time on Pretty Little Thing. And I'm like, yeah, girl, we need to have this dress. I got the dress in a medium and it fit like a glove. It had the right amount of stretch. And I added this bag from the Columbia trip again. So once you buy something you don't need to buy, keep buying a bunch of things. Well, for me, I would get accumulate a bunch of stuff and then I mix and match them on another trip. So that's what I did with this bag orange bag so it, it matches the, the cues and colors in the dress and then I added this orange earring that I got from Shein as well and it went with it so perfectly and the sandals the orange sandals from Shein and then we added the bangles from Shein also so I might wear this dress again this dress is coming somewhere wherever I'm going next I'm gonna wear this dress again so don't be saying nothing if you see me in this dress we're gonna we're gonna rinse and repeat now this outfit right here y'all don't understand loved it as soon as I saw the cardigan I'm like I need this cardigan in my life I don't know how I'm gonna wear it but I'm gonna wear it somehow like the colors were so bright and giving and it was a little bit different than um, some of the sheet and pieces that I would see because you know a lot of times you'd be shopping in a sheet and you're like Yeah, you already seen somebody in this before it doesn't matter though because it's how you dressed it up But it was new at the point that I saw it and I haven't even saw it on the popular side of the website I don't know if it's because I already bought it and then the bag I'm like I need a bag to go with this cardigan That's gonna really take the colors to a whole new height like let's let's brighten everything up so I found this yellow bag and I'm like yes this is giving vacation it's giving everything that I need and then we have that orange sandals again because you know we gotta we gotta pair it up we gotta use it and reuse it and reuse it and the quality of sheet and sandals are really good because none of my sandals from Shein have popped or ruined or well some of them have been scratched up in the front because i i don't know if i walk bad or if i just drag my feet or if i'm just clumsy and i'm just always hitting the front of my toes but they do have scratches in the front but overall with the quality of the sandals they do last a really good amount of time now the shorts the shorts are from i want to say they're from shein as well and i'm i am wearing the body chain like the body the, the waist chain it's essential. I'm in love with waist changes. They just give me this sexy look, especially sometimes when I don't feel as super confident as I can with, you know, like my lovely extraness around the waist. When I wear a waist chain, it's like instant, girl. What are you even? What are you even critiquing with the body? It is giving. So waist chain. If you can drop it anywhere, just like a pinch of salt. That's what it is it gives that extra flavor earrings I got from Sheen as well these yellow beautiful square earrings I just put on a cross necklace the top the orange top is also from Sheen I bought yellow and orange to see which one looked best with the cardigan and the orange was just doing it for me like orange orange is my new color and then we added the bangles from Sheen Next on our trip docket, we went to St. Lucia. Now, if you haven't seen my St. Lucia vlog, you need to go watch my St. Lucia vlog. St. Lucia was such a vibe. It was a little bit different in terms of St. Lucia gives me a naturistic, a nature outdoorsy type of feel. It's very much tropical, but it gives me rainforest. It gives me lots of trees. It gives me mountains and waterfalls. So when I go to like 
say I went to Aruba, it was more flat. So it was, you know, that direct sun on you. St. Lucia gave me more of a chill, cool vibe. But the sun was still, still glowing on the skin. So this next outfit I got from fashion nova the bathing suit was sold together kimono was sold separately so i saw the kimono first because i went on fashion nova i'm like i haven't been on fashion nova in a long time so i went on fashion nova and i went in their vacation section i saw the kimono i'm like yellow yes i need to have it <laughs> like the color the color yellow a yellow kimono like that and it was on sale let me have it Thank you. So I found the yellow bathing suit and we created a whole look. The hat, I've had this hat for a minute. I got the hat from, uh, girl, where did I get this hat from? I think I got it from Fashion Nova. It was flipped over like they sewed the front part together and I popped it. The bag again is from Pretty Little Thing. And of course, you know, the razzle dazzle, the earrings and the waist chain. Always instant instant oomph it brings any outfit simple whether bathing suit or anything and it raised the bar now this picture right here it's this set that i'm wearing i'm wearing the pants right now in this video because listen a lot of times when you wear open you put them on with a different hairstyle in a different setting and it's just giving a whole different vibe because in this picture it is giving tropical vacation right now it's giving um Oh no, housewife sitting in the living room type of vibe. I don't know what it's giving right now, but it's giving something. And I'm gonna wear it again and again and again. I got it in brown too. It's from Pretty Little Thing. The pants and the top. I think they're sold separately. I got it in dark brown and I got it in this tan color. Now for the top for the outfit, I got this from Shein. And I even wore it in my Columbia. I wore it. In Colombia as well but I didn't take any pictures but I'm like I wasn't in love with the outfit too much in Colombia so I'm like we're gonna recycle this so we're gonna take it to St. Lucia and we're gonna revisit the whole outfit concept and I put those together and they were just magnificent together then I added that pretty little thing bag like I don't know what I'm gonna do with that bag um, when it's ruined because I have a little like food got on it and it's not in the best condition right now but i'm really sad i don't know what i'm gonna do but we're gonna try to find a bag together very similar to that another jewelry i got from shein and then we got this dupe from amazon amazon is a plug out of those jewelry i had a cute simple little earring because i didn't want to do even though we love our signature earrings it was giving soft like super super soft so i didn't want to overwhelm the look with um, chunky gold earrings so we stick to something more simple and subtle and then for my shoes I was wearing my Chanel sandals now these Chanel sandals I love them because as opposed to other designer sandals that have like a leather finishing especially my Louis Vuitton sandals they have like a leather finishing so if I just brush my foot somewhere it's gonna scratch but with those Chanel sandals because they were made for the beach, love it. So I carried on um, mostly every vacation I go on. Just it goes with anything. Well, not everything, but it goes with most beach loungy type of look. And I'm obsessed. This green outfit right here. A lot of people thought it was a dress. I thought it was a dress too, but it's actually a set. And what I love about this set is that. It could be worn anyhow you want it to, but I chose to wear it like how it was on the website with it like, you know, being in the front, but you could tie it like a, a little bralette looking situation. But what is that bandeau? That's a bandeau, right? Like you can wear it like that. It's from Chick Le Freak Freak. I think it's Chick Le Freak. Or Chick Le Freak Freak. Guys is a store in dubai like i was on pinterest looking at outfits and i saw this outfit that i really liked and then you know with pinterest it has the link so it took me to this website i'm like oh the clothes are nice it didn't have the outfit that i wanted anymore but it did have some pieces that i'm like mm, it's a little bit more pricey than my usual sheet in but you know we gotta live a little and we wanted things that look a little bit different so with me a lot of times in 
like when I went on vacation, I get at least two more, I wouldn't call them luxury sets, but like a mid price range. They're not super expensive and they're not cheap and affordable. They're just right in the middle. I like those because they give a little bit of a difference. They look different. Like you're not going to see a million people in that outfit. So I liked it. So I'm like, you know, what? I'm going to get that. It fit lovely. It was a little bit complicated with the skirt because I thought my hoo-ha, all my chun-chun was going to be out in the wind because of how high the split was. But you can just tie it anyhow you want. The material on it is really thick and rich. Well, I don't know if I would call it rich, but in terms of like the quality of the material, it was a really good quality. Like you're you're seeing what you're paying for with that outfit. I got a sandals two years ago from Zara. Um, it's a strappy sandal, love it. The bag I got from Shein, and I've I've featured this bag in my previous Shein haul. So if you want, you can go to that that Shein haul and see some of the stuff that I featured on there. But I love this gold bag from Shein. Like everybody needs this gold bag from Shein, and I think a lot of people have this gold bag from Shein that we got the Shein bangles as well. And then I added those earrings that I told you about from Pretty Little Thing brought it back to St. Lucia and it was a lot. Also from that same website, I got this two piece set. Now I had mixed feelings about this particular set because I, I wasn't sure about the material. Like it's cute, but the material, the feel of the, the material wasn't giving me um, 90 plus Canadian dollars that I paid for it with, but I let it slide because it wasn't too bad. Like it was actually really cute. And again, it was different. So I went with it being different and I think these items were handmade by the brand. I don't know. I could just be making that up. I'm not even sure. I opted not to wear anything on anything because I was living dearly. I was living that dear life, that sexy dear life. So I didn't wear anything under there. Just the kimono and the shorts. And then these yellow um, sandals I got from Shein. The bag from Shein. And then the signature earrings, you know, to make the, the, the look pop, to kick off the look. Okay, and then I wore a simple cross chain. And then my typical rings, you know, also want to be in the collection. And that was a look. Like, it was very flowy. It was it was very much in a tropical paradise type of look. Is this zebra? Is this zebra print, right? Well, this black and white dress, I got it from Shein a while ago. I think I got it last year, this time probably. And I've brought it on other trips before. But again, you're not going to just wear your stuff one time. We got to rinse and repeat until we get the looks and the looks and the looks out of it. So love this dress. I got it in a medium. And then I added this bag from Shein, the signature earrings. And then we had the bangles and also that strappy black and gold sandal from Zara. Love it. The look was absolutely giving. And now for our final look, it is very much Fashion Nova. The kimono actually came with the shorts. And I was going to wear it for something else. But um, it wasn't like a picture moment, like I didn't take a picture in it because it was just like chill, you know, just a chill vibe. But with the kimono, I used the shirt. It's not a kimono, it's a shirt. I used a shirt for like a pool type of look. So the set, the bathing suit set, the white set is actually from Pretty Little Thing. A Pretty Little Thing white set is like $5 for the top, $5 for the bottom type of thing. And then we wore the signature earrings. Okay. You know signature earrings with everything and then the waist chain to make us look extra snatched and that was it and i wore a white sandal for the look okay, so that is the end of our what i wore on vacation slash vacation lookbook let me know what you guys think of the outfits that i wore everything will be linked in the description box down below especially this number that i'm wearing right here because girl she is super cutesy so i'll link that as well for you if you want to purchase this and then be on the lookout for the launch when i actually launch these earrings like i'm working on it okay i'm working on it i'm working on it i'm gonna get it out there for y'all because i 
this isn't this isn't a secret like we gotta share the jewelry okay we gotta share it so that is all that i have for you guys today don't forget to subscribe to my channel let me know if you want to see more videos like this what i wore type of videos like comment let me feel the love okay and all that good stuff and i'll see y'all beautiful people in my next video go on big up in yourself bye guys Mwah.